Hello everyone, we're here for our next read aloud. Today we are going to be reading this story called Bat Count, a citizen science story. It's by Anna Forrester, illustrated by Susan Detweiler. Um, it's all about this girl named Jojo, and she's prepping for an exciting night. It's time for the Bat Count. Um, so, citizens, a citizen science project is a project where like regular people are doing big science experience, science, big science kind of projects, experiments, um, to help other scientists. And it usually has to do with, like, animals and plant life. Um, but it can be about other things, too. But that's what um, her and her family are doing. A big kind of citizen science science project. Um, it has to do all about bats. Uh, it's, a, it's a really good story. Uh, for this, we are going to be focusing on this goal. Read this with me and I can recount. Ready? I can recount the plot of a story, and use key events to explain the central message, lesson, or moral. So recount really means to describe. So we're going to be trying to describe kind of like the plot or like really what the story is all about. And we're going to use key events or those really important parts to explain that central message, lesson, or moral. And I always like to think that central message, lesson, or moral is like that big life lesson. What are you supposed to learn? Now, as we're do to help us with that today, we're going to be using... Um, uh, this graphic organizer, we're going to be using the Reading Fiction Summary. So I'm going to open this up. It's called the Reading Summary Idea Sheet. And we're going to be using Somebody Wanted, But So Then. So I'm just going to go through this sheet just to help. So you can send this off to Notability. Um, and I just have it open up, up on Notability, and you can have it all ready. Um, but the way it works is there's two columns. So we have the key information. So we have Somebody. Somebody... Who is the main character in the story? And then right next to it, we have the note section. So that's where you'd write down the person. So, somebody. Who's the main character in the story? Then the next section is wanted. What is the main character's goal? Wanted. Then we have but. What is the conflict or problem getting in the way of the character's goal? But. So, how did the character try to solve the problem? So, then what was the resolution? Then, um, so it really works with somebody wanted... But something got in their way, so how did they try to solve it? Then what was the resolution or that ending? Because resolution, um, for so for a resolution, that's a, just another great way to just to say like ending. Like how did how did everything end for that resolution? Then we have the summary. So for the summary, you take all of these parts right here, in all of these boxes, and you put it together for the summary, and then you can finish with the lesson down at the bottom. I'm um, gonna just stop there. Make sure my oh, did lose the book. I'm stopping here anyway, though. Um, when we come back, we're gonna take a look through the book and we could do some thinking. See you right back.